Have you ever found yourself in a, in a session or in a moment when you are worried about the future and how things are going to happen? If you ever found yourself complaining about the unfairness of God, sometimes you say in your life that God is not fair. When you look around your life, when you look around how things are happening in your life. Today I want to encourage you. Did you know that the shares or the things you do will determine the results and the benefits you're going to get. Look at the lady in the book of Luke chapter 10. We see two ladies, one by the names of Mary and Martha. Mary chose to sit at the feet of Jesus Christ and Martha was distracted by a lot. The Bible says when Martha complained and, he told, and she told Jesus that my sister is just seated down and I'm here struggling alone. Jesus told Martha that Martha, Mary has chosen to do what is good and it's the best you know the bible continues to say that jesus told martha that what mary has chosen to do will never be taken away from her and you have been distracted by a lot mary chose to sit at the feet of jesus christ to heed the word of god this simply means he ch she, she chose to sit at the feet of jesus christ to learn to love to know more about god and to do the will of god praise the lord and to do the will of god but martha was distracted by a lot and we see the results jesus is saying that what mary has chosen to do will never be taken away from her if you choose to do it today to do the will of god if you choose today to obey god to follow god to sit at the feet of jesus christ to do the will of god to love him to know more about him i am giving you guaranteed this is guaranteed in the word of god it will never be taken away from you the bible says choose do first seek the kingdom of god and everything and all you need will be added onto you onto you but martha was distracted by a lot sometimes the things you choose to do will determine your results what are you doing today what is taking your time what is making you so busy try to check your results and know what are the results of what I'm doing? If the results bring pain and complaint, today I guarantee you, choose to do the will of God. Choose to follow God. Choose to obey God. And your life will not remain the same. I want you to take this option that Mary took. It chose to sit at the feet of Jesus Christ. And, and the Bible says that will never be taken away from her. Anything that deals with God is internal the things you do for God are internal but the things you do alone they will only bring a lot of pain and destruction hallelujah so I want to leave this word with you my brother and my sister that is watching me today if you choose to follow God if you choose to obey God if you choose to read the word of God if you choose to do the will of God that is internal the blessing that will come will be internal the victory you will get will be internal the, 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 the financial breakthrough you will get will be internal everything that comes from God will be internal but the things you used to do that are distracting you that are stopping you from doing the will of God that are preventing you from following God they will only bring destruction destruction in your life they will only bring pain and you will end up trying to regret why this is happening to me god bless you as you choose wisely i want to leave this scripture with you thumbs chapter 37 in verses 51 the bible says i was young but now i'm grown i've grown i've never seen i've never seen a righteous person crying or begging for bread if you choose to follow god you will never cry you will never beg for bread because the bible says that seek ye first the kingdom of god according to matthew 6 33 and all these things you need will follow you if you choose to love god if you choose to follow god i'm giving you guarantee that wherever you need whatever you need is going to be given to you and whatever god is going to give you will be internal no one will take it away from you god bless you as you choose wisely pastor don nicholas mixer bye bye